Now let's jump into the visited place page. Well, uh, open this in a new tab. Close. Okay, before closing this one, I would like to save this section. About me section. Because uh, inside the visited place page, there will be a section looks like this. That's why I have saved this as template. Close this one right now and make sure you have disabled the title and featured image you could disable breadcrumbs or not in my about page i disable the breadcrumbs accidentally but if you do not then no worry it will not going to display on your page click on update make sure you have changed the layout from here to full width stretch layout click update and now go to the page and okay click edit with elementor there is another section that i think i have missed which is page header which is called page header this one so this section i should export or save as template now i have to go to about me again and i have to save this section because this section is also available inside the visited place section save it here as template call it page header because it's a header not a menu with the menu it's a page header inside the page not inside the menu now go to elementor and click over here template insert page header change the title let's take a look visited place and export image from here double click over here click on export export this one and click on this section icon here style image change it from here just upload this image add the alternative text here text or something else that uh, is uh, refers to this image that describe the image i think you already know it now you do not have to change anything else here because we have already changed them and if i go to another section which looks like this let's import about me section here and reposition the column just drag it to the left side and that's all change a copy the text from here export the image paste the text here so it's very easy now uh, when you complete front page and about page the rest of the page will be easier for you because there is just copy paste and you have to export import page most of the visitor are uh, attract with the front page not other pages so that's why it's very important and i'd like to delete this one so i have completed this section i think you have noticed that how quickly i have completed this one and also this one takes less time let's create and place where i have visited insert this section scroll down let's delete this button because we do not want to use this one at this moment and there is a three row and now i just duplicate this and here you can see three rows so you can make it as pop-up or also you can make this when someone click read more they will go to your blog post or single page so you can just create those page and add link here and there will be some other way for creating this kind of sections so which is pretty advanced and 
in the future i will also show you how to create custom post custom meta box using elementor pro and some other uh, third party plugins okay so close and open this one now let's go back to our image there is a newsletter and as seen in section so i think i have missed again the copy as seen in section from about me page let's visit page again about me and save this as seen in section as a template go to edit with elementor scroll down and just save it as template as seen in click save and just paste it here or just export it so now it's complete there's another section which is called newsletter sign up so we have just completed our place where I have visited uh, visited place page very quickly so it just takes uh, less than I think it takes less than 10 minutes I'm not sure I cannot uh, view the duration of this video at this moment here but it takes less than 10 minutes I think so in the next part I'll be creating the blog page thank you so much for watching this